Hello, welcome to another video. My name's a Clickster, and today we are having a look at Rogue Ascent VR or Ascent VR. Um, so yeah, this is basically it's just a shooting game, um, first-person shooter, up. And uh, the reason this game is quite clever is, uh, well, I'll show you. I shall remove my controllers. My controllers have been removed. And there we go, look, it's full and tracking. I can do, hello, how are you? I can give people their finger and we can do lots of, and we can do doggies. I mean, it's endless what you can do with your hands. Um, so yeah, it uses hand tracking, which is really cool. You can, if you want to, use controllers. Um, but hey, you know, the main kind of, uh, I suppose feature of this game is the hand tracking. So that's what we're gonna look at. Um, as with hand tracking, you need to make sure you're in a well-lit room. Um, make sure your sleeves are rolled up and you've not got any watches on, bracelets, anything like that. Um, so yeah, let's get cracking. I have had a quick go at the tutorial just to get an idea of how to, to move around. Um, so yeah, let's, let's, uh, let's get into the game. Right, bigger class loadout. Uh, rogue, standard challenge. Medical, that's an intense challenge. I don't think we'd be doing that. Uh, configure, uh, what's that one? Moderate. Oh, so you've got like, so things like, looks like things like health, heal, stamina. Looks like they all kind of change. Traveler. Look, that's a standard challenge. <laughs> uh, we'll try that one. Okay, so there is, uh, I will be sort of turning around quite a lot. So I do apologize if I've got my back to you and you can see my big old bunda at the back there. So I do apologize, but uh, <laughs> let's get into it. So, uh, for me to basically call my gun, you do like a gun. There you go, I've got rid of your gun, and then your gun appears. Uh, if you want to get rid of your gun, open your hand up, the gun disappears again. Uh, when you want to reload, you, have to, you basically just point it up into the air and it does a spinny thing and reloads. Let's get rid of that. Also got a very cool thing on my watch here, uh, so I can see if there's any threats about. Just gonna scan. I can see we've got some baddies over there. That's really cool. Um, what else? I've got a shield, so you get your field up like that. You get your shield out. So, I mean, yeah, it's really, it's very, very cool. Uh, to move about, so basically, so you've got these little, well, there you go. <laughs> yeah, basically, you, you, pop, you cover your hand over where you want to go. Let's get the gun out, because it does fire, but it fires automatically. Right, upper deck. Let's go to the upper deck. Let's open up. Right, anything around. Scan for threats. Some threats over there. Boom, baby. Boom, baby. My thing up. What's it doing? What's it doing? Why is it in slow motion? Why is it in slow motion? Security what? Oh my god, oh my god. Oh no, what's done man? What have I done? Have I made a mistake? Oh this is a bit tense. 
Oh, I think I needed some health. But I was low on health. That made you mind. I was like. Oh, look at this. Health on him, man. I'm not going to put a shield down. You're going to fire at me. Oh, shit. Shit. No, 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 no. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, it's already used. Man, I'm not doing very good here. I'm not doing very good at all. I really need some. Uh... Gun. Objective completed. Love that. Do I get to keep this gun? This heavy sniper. Ooh. Ooh. Now entering Concourse Two. Ooh, restricted. Okay, it's got the old. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh shit, it's quite a lot over there. Let's get the big one out. How are we doing? How are we diddling? Do we do quite well then? <gasps> no, I want that. No, I want that. Oh. What's this? Oh, okay. Why are they getting crosses up on them? Is any idea why they get? Defeated? Get out of it. What? Oh, man. <coughs> oh, here we go. Gang 
gameplay over right total runtime nearly 15 minutes Floor's completely three patch to 14 damage dealt so you've got all your uh, all your stuff there rank s plus does that mean ship s for ship health intellect sneak fortune okay i mean there's a lot of Uh, you know what, I'm going to have a, another quick go um, with the patrollers just to see, I don't know, to see how the experience differs. Let me just grab my folders quick just to see if I think it's easier or more difficult or more enjoyable with the hands. Let's see, it's great for the patrollers to go up. There we go. Right, so uh, let's. I figure out what controls do what now. Uh, so I do I. Oh, so I still pretty much. Okay, so I still move my hands around like you were. Oh, so you still have to do your fist. So it's pretty much so you get to. Oh, the only thing is, so it's not. It's not automatic, so with your hands, as soon as, you put, as soon as you point your gun, it fires at something. Whereas this one, you can actually you can use a trigger. You still hold upwards to do. Okay, so that's the, that looks like the only difference. You still, so you, st you still don't move around with the joysticks. You're still having to hold your hand up to hover about. So that's all the, the same. So it's really, and it looks like it's a different map as well. Looks like the maps change. Okay, that's interesting. Okay, so we're now in a restricted area. Let's open up. So yeah, so the oh, I didn't do my thing. shield up maybe not maybe I didn't have my shield up I thought I had my shield up right yeah that S definitely stands for shit because <laughs> that was shit I was awful that time I thought I had my shield up. I thought I was blocking oh, maybe so to be honest I actually I preferred it with the hand tracking now, yeah, that's a bit of a rarity, isn't it? So, um, I've played games before with hand tracking, uh, like uh, Forever Darts. Now, Forever Darts, I preferred with the controllers, because uh, I found, because you moved your hand at quite a speed to throw the darts, it would lose the tracking of your hands. Um, playing this game, it hasn't lost any tracking of my hand movement at all, so that's really good. Um, the only thing I do prefer um, is, the, is the trigger, is the fire, is the shooting the gun. You know, I'm not just going. To, I, I can control when I fire the gun. That's the only plus side I see with the uh, with the controllers. So, but oh, so overall, I actually prefer playing with uh, the, the, the hand tracking, uh, which is really, really cool. Let's end the run. So, if you're up for a bit of a challenge, then I would highly recommend this game. Hey, it's called Rogue Sent to BR, as you can see there. Uh, it's on App Labs. It is in beta version at the moment. Uh, it's $14.99. Um, but there's a lot to do. There's loads of levels, uh, loads of gun selections. You saw there's loads of uh, the vending machines. There was loads of the old um, like special abilities uh, to unlock. So it's, it's a big old game. Uh, it's certainly a good challenge, so I'd highly recommend it. So that was a standard challenge, and I'm finding that difficult. So you can see they've obviously got some things in the pipeline. 
Uh, obviously there's game modes as well, which obviously it's all grayed out at the moment. So obviously they're working on something there. So obviously that's going to come about. Knowledge base, I'm not sure what that is. But again, that's grayed out. So obviously that's something they're going to add to the game as well. Um, so yeah, I, uh, uh, I, I, I would highly recommend this game. I'm going to carry on playing this game see if I can get past the level but yeah I just thought I'd give you guys just a little look-see because these hand tracking games uh, you know you never know what you're gonna get really so, you know some hand tracking games are absolutely awful um, but I'm glad to say this is one of the, 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 the really good ones um, like I said earlier I didn't lose any of my hand tracking at all it was always in the game um, no matter how quick I was moving my hands it always it always saw them all the time so that's really good and getting around as well was I found very simple uh, and it's and we have the hand controls are dead, dead simple to do you know just so anyway thank you for watching and uh, yeah the best way for my channel if you can like the video uh, and subscribe to my channel that's the best way you can support me um, you know obviously the views if you want to share the video that would be great also um, but yeah thank you for watching and I will see you on the next one. See you later, peeps.